This is Gene Key for KDD Texas News. From Midland, a small plane crashed into a residential neighborhood in Midland Friday morning, hitting two houses. The pilot and an elderly woman inside one of the homes survived. Quality Lease, the company that owns the plane, has identified the pilot as Paige Mund from Needville in Wharton County. Wharton County Regional Airport officials told KOSA TV in Midland the plane took off from their airport Friday morning. The 1979 Beach King Air F-90 was headed to Midland Air Park when something went wrong around 8 a.m. The plane crashed near the back of one house, damaging the storage room and part of a garage. The plane then traveled across an alleyway and smashed into a second house, which caught fire and was destroyed. An 81-year-old woman was inside one of the homes. She and her two dogs were rescued unharmed. Lund was taken to a Midland hospital where he was last reported in stable condition. Lund is a pilot for Quality Lease in El Campo. From Grossbeck, Texas, the AP reports imperiled towns around drought-ravaged Texas are finding short-term fixes to water supply problems. Some are coming up just in time to avert a crisis. Massive yellow pipes are being pieced together as part of a $250,000 pipeline project in the central Texas city of Grosbeck, which was expected to run out of water by Tuesday. The pipeline will bring water from a rock quarry seven miles away, but it's only a six-month supply. The Texas Commission on Environmental Quality says there are 11 towns with enough water to last six months or less. The Associated Press reports from Grand Prairie, a North Texas worker hanging Christmas lights on a historic building has died after being electrocuted. Grand Prairie police say the man was moving a 40-foot-tall aluminum ladder when it fell onto the power lines Friday morning. He had been standing on the ground but was still holding onto the ladder. 51-year-old Jans René Gardner died at a hospital where he was taken after emergency personnel started CPR at the scene. If you would like the latest Dumas, Panhandle, and Texas news on your mobile device, you can follow KDD News on YouTube. Simply search KDDD or Gene Key on Facebook or Twitter. This is Gene Key for KDD Texas News.